Welcome to Rebel Live. I am your hostess with the mostest, IR Girl. What's up, guys? Hyperkind here. We're finally live! <laughs> We're finally live! For and, and difficulties. There's no, there's no Tom tonight. We miss you, Tom! Tom, we miss you. Wait, I want you to look at the, the it's video not the stream. Same without you. John, look at the video stream in a minute because I'm going to show you who is replacing Tom tonight. It's going to show our hosts in a minute. But, please um, work but right yes, <laughs> please work right. Please Hard transition. Work, <laughs> there we go. So, yeah. um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing I notice is the gap in his front teeth. I know. Uh, Tom's going to kill me, but uh, maybe we'll be lucky and he'll, uh, he'll <laughs> pop in. Tom's actually in the midst of moving this weekend, so he couldn't join us tonight. Hopefully he is, uh, he is listening. We miss him and his logical self in our stream yeah. so he oh man yes but, but yes this is a I, I was kind of hoping for a car cardboard cutout picture i know of i know i i i couldn't figure out how to do that being that we're live streaming on the internet so <laughs> if i had a backdrop a green screen then i could have like tom clancy cut out sitting next to me maybe that's what we'll do in the fall because in the fall this coming up fall you know like before winter um, we're gonna be going on camera. We're all gonna be on. Oh, camera. I've got to. I've got to give you the new. Picture. I've got to give you the one with the, with the Ninja Turtle glasses. Yes. That, that's oh, gonna yeah. be the new picture. That I'm gonna have you use. All right. Yeah, we'll definitely use that. All right. <laughs> so everybody, welcome to the chat. We've got um, a lot of stuff to. No, we don't have a. No, we don't because no, no. I have. I have cut John back on. I I was restrained. <laughs> I was. I I was proud of myself. You I did. Don't, Put up like two or three things. To, you to put talk up like about. three things, and that was it. And I was honestly like, very, very proud of you. So, um, right. so yeah, I was. Um, I am very um, happy that we're finally live, and I'm I'm happy that uh, that gap in the front teeth, Tom Clancy, can join us. <laughs> ah. <laughs> but now I have two browsers open, so. Um, I guess, uh, let's go in. We're going to start, actually, Tom, um, before he decided he couldn't be with us this weekend, gave us a, um, oh, a transition, Steph, transition. There we go. All right, if you want to post the link up for me, John. Adult women are now the largest demographic in gaming. Let's see how our all-male yeah. audience chat feels about that. So um, let me see here. Um, a new study released by the Entertainment Software Association has revealed that adult women now occupy the largest demographic in the gaming industry. Women over 18 made up a whopping 36% of the gaming population, followed by adult men at 35%. Um, if you scroll down in this article, it shows you the average game player is 31 years old. So that kind of wipes out the image of the teenage boy sitting in his basement, Rob. So you're out of that demographic now. <laughs> so, uh, I don't, honestly, I personally, I only but, the only person I know who plays video games who's a female mm. is there's there's you. Okay, and I was gonna say if you don't say there's, me, there's two other people. There's two other people. <laughs> so and but yeah, honestly, I don't. Well, I I don't really have a social life. I I stay home and game, but. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I know a lot more male gamers than... Um, so do I, but I think... Female. You know what? If you read through the article, though, I was a little disappointed because... Um, but they used every demographic of gamers, including... Get ready to cringe, everybody. Those Facebook games. Are so, you fucking kidding me? And I me? think that's where they came up with a lot of their... Demo now, if... Daily Dot, I'm sorry. You, you've lost all... All, all interest. If I, I scrolled through there, but um, but they still say that because they said, let me see, I'm trying to find it. I should have highlighted this really quick. Um, it says, uh, so what games have these women been playing all these years? Now that we know, they haven't just been wasting time trying to get their Facebook friends to give them free lives on Candy Crush. Um, oh, I play Farmville. No, no, it says casual oh. computer games mostly. Um, the report ranks online and mobile puzzle games, board games, trivia games. See, so it, to me, it's kind of off a little bit. Um, you know, and then we're going to get into the debate of what what do you consider, you know, a gamer? Is it somebody that games mobile, you know, uh, Facebook games? They're games. They play them. You know, does that define a gamer? I don't, you know, I don't know. I don't want to go into that debate. 
Um, but I know that, uh, um, that, but they go on to say, before everybody freaks out, um, meanwhile, action and first-person shooter games continue to be the top sellers in video games with Grand Theft Auto and Call of Duty ranking as the best-selling video games. For computer games, for women, it was StarCraft II, The Sims franchise, and, uh, well, The Sim titles, all of them. So, um... <laughs> Uh, I, know. I, I, I don't know. Including Facebook games in there, kind of, I don't know. It, it just feels like it, it brings it down, and it just. Well, I think so too. And I'm a female gamer, you know. I, I don't, um, you know, because if you if you put that demographic in it, then you've got like these, like seventy year old gamers. That <laughs> it's okay, but but I don't consider Farmville being, you know, a hardcore gamer. It's like I'm playing Candy Crush, yo. I'm a hardcore gamer. It's like, <laughs> you know, no. I don't, I don't see no. a whole lot of over forty women coming off Facebook with their freaking gaming glasses on and their <laughs> their MLG T-shirts. Going, <laughs> going, yo, Farmville. <laughs> you know, so <laughs> gotta harvest my crops, yo. Visit my farm. <laughs> I gotta have you pull the weeds. <laughs> there you go. MLG Farmville. <laughs> and yes, it, it's me with complete prejudice against people who play Farmville and no, I mean, no, I mean, I, in a way, I you know, I'm happy that <laughs> that uh, uh, gaming opens up a, a new realm for people that maybe have never tried gaming, so maybe they can understand the the gaming mindset or the gamer mindset a little bit by playing games like that. But I also think that I've heard recordings on the radio of crazy women over their facebook games like like uh, there was one the daughter it was one of those prank calls from the radio shows and she something happened she was she adds money to her her farmville account like hardcore and her mother her daughter pranked her saying that there was a problem with her account she was they were going to reset her account this woman flipped she was like 50-something years old, maybe 60. She was flipping out over Farmville. And I said, that's just wrong. If you want to flip out over, like, Call of Duty, or recently for me, last night it was Guild Wars. <laughs> I raged oh, and quit. Oh, yeah, I, 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 I saw the, I oh, saw the yeah. brief moment of, of Game of Rage. Yeah, I was like, fuck this game. I'm not playing it. One flipping game. tables. Flipping fuck this shit. Right? <laughs> Throwing my mouse pad across the room. <laughs> So, but you know, no hate on the women and the gaming. I think uh, I think any you know form of gaming is is good. It's part no, of no no hate on the gaming. No hate on the gender no, of the gamer. No, not at all. But a lot um, of hate. But I don't think you can do. I don't think you can do a valid. Uh, I don't know. Let, you know, I think maybe they should go and survey only console gamers or only PC gamers. You know what I mean? And see anything the... that's not on Facebook. Yeah, anything that's not on Facebook. <laughs> that would work. I, I cannot What about have... mobile? What about mobile? Like... I'm per... You know what? You know what? People... I play Clash of Clans. I've gotten into that. So, I mean, I... I can have a little bit more respect. So, at the bottom of the totem pole, it's Facebook gamers. Right. And then we have yeah, mobile gamers, like, on their phone. Right. And then... After that, we but got like. You know what I see as a, a lot of mobile gamers too, though, are gamers that are in between like work and home, and before they get home to the PC or the console, they're on their phone playing. Yeah, a lot that, of times that's I so think, much uh, better uh, than freaking Farmville PC? and anything on Facebook you can find. What can you play? The only thing I know is you got like Farmville and Candy Crush on Facebook. What else do they have? I don't even know. I don't I'm, know. I I. Play that one stupid game every once in a while, and I feel guilty. <gasps> I'm not even gonna say it either, and it's my kids' fault because they're like, "Mom, oh, can you just play you. so you can send us shit?" And I'm like, "No, because if it gets out there, everybody's gonna know." <laughs> so, oh, dare you! I used to like when my when my kids first joined Facebook, they played Farmville and they played with like um, their uh, fathers side of the family like their entire family so they were building these farms or, and i remember um it was either my daughter or my youngest son was like i need like one more person added so that i can i don't know get my farm bigger or whatever i forget what it was 
So I was yeah. like, fine. So I, I played it so that I could send them whatever they needed to make their... Or they needed one more friend to make their farm bigger. <laughs> so I Screw did it. That, now, you know, you know on my Twitter how it spits out when I start playing a game? It goes, yeah. it's making men into boys while kicking their ass on Farmville. And it spit it <laughs> out. And I was like, mother... I seriously went through. I'm like, deleting, deleting, Delete deleting. Tweets. Oh, man. But once it was out there, everybody knew. It was so embarrassing. I'm like, oh. I'll then, admit, you know, I, I played Farmville for a little bit, but af after true, a while, it's like, not again, not again. <laughs> and then I still get, I still get, like, the request for it, and I was like, oh, fuck this shit, no. I know, right? Ignore all. No, that's And funny. I feel kind of bad, because, I mean, there's some family members sending me, Mafia you know, wars. there's like, click this and you'll get coins, or they'd like to request this from you. It's like, I feel bad about ignoring anything from them, right. but... I have to admit, the amount of game stuff that's appeared on my feed has ended, so I feel so much better. That's good. So here's the big news this week as well. We has new masters! <laughs> we have new masters, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I don't know. I, you know, it's one billion dollars, so, you know, it's a, it's a big deal. If you read the article, or the I don't know if you read the it. The news from. that exploded yeah. all over the internet, face, social know. media. Did you, were you just going to say that it exploded all over your face? Well, <laughs> that's on, what it sounded well, like you were going to say. On <laughs> Facebook and Twitter, I mean, instead of saying both of that, social media combines them both. It, yes. It's like, I, I first noticed a couple of tweets happening and then just mm -hmm. my entire timeline. Well, we, we touched on this like two, on three shows ago. We touched that this was a rumor, but it was a, we we said that Amazon was and but who was supposed to be buying them? I forget. Before um, Amazon, Google was Google. supposed to be. That's right. That's what our article down. was. Yeah, they backed out because of some antitrust issues, is what I read. Right. So they're like, okay, no, we're good, we're out. But then, yeah, and then Amazon came up out of nowhere, and it mm -hmm. wasn't even a rumor. It just popped up out of nowhere. It's like. 30 minutes before every, it was officially announced, like Amazon rumored to buy Twitch, and 30 minutes later, it's official. Yeah, it was official. Amazon bought Twitch for like 970 million, and then shit just went batshit crazy, and we're here now. <laughs> yeah, so um, there's um, rumored that there's a huge breakup fee if if Amazon decides to any time because I guess I guess it's official but it's not official until all the paperwork's gone through and everything like that and if they back out there's a huge fine for them like so much so that like it wouldn't be worth it or something like that yeah. so as far as the CEO um, what's his name Emmett Shear Emmett. says yeah. there will be no changes just more improvements and I have a problem with that right there so how I just I'm Twitch is not my friend today. that's all I'm saying <laughs> it's just I'm I'm very unhappy with their muting of my streams. That's all. Like I didn't even like it's a good thing I record everything as I'm live streaming yeah. because la last night I got I stopped my Twitch and it was like not even 30 seconds and the entire thing was muted. Oh yeah, their algorithm algorithms It was like wow. So I was like, "Oh yeah, Twitch Fuck you, I recorded it, bitch. <laughs> so there. So I'm uploading it to YouTube anyways, and it just won't be monetized because it has music in it. But, but yeah, so big big deal. They made it on Forbes, Wall Street Journal, Bloomberg's report. So, so yeah, it's a big, big money-making deal. So I, what, I don't know what upgrades we could see. Hopefully they're something wonderful and important. I am, yeah, I mean, hopefully no, no bad changes. I mean, I am really curious as to if there's going to be anything changed on the caster side. I mean, yeah, from since that since this has been announced, we have yet to hear anything else about it. So I am... Yeah, we haven't really, we, except for when the, the what's-his-name posted statement that nothing will change. Because everybody's yeah, like, and that was oh it. my god, uh, what's going to change? Ever since then, it's like nobody's brought up anything about it. I mean... What's yeah. going on? I don't know. We must know. We must know stuff. So we can talk about it. So, um, speaking about knowing 
stuff about people and stuff. Our very own Tom Clancy, as I transition this delay. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was waiting not, for it. It's not as quick it. as, as I would have liked it to be tonight. <laughs> I was like, she, she's almost there. We there we go. There we go. <laughs> Our own Tom Clancy got there quoted go. in IGN's blog. Uh, he was the he was actually the quote of the week on IGN on one of their blog pages, and he said, "Fellow video game enthusiasts, we need to be better human beings." That's that's right from Tom Clancy. I'm very proud of him, and uh, he showed me that this week. I says I'm going to put it in the news articles because he is one of ours, and. Uh, He's yeah. in the chat right now. I, I see him in the chat. Yeah. Hi, Tom! <laughs> he was trying to slyly be in there. But see, he heard us talking about him. That Tom Clancy. Tom, did you... Wait. Tom, did you see your picture? I I added you. What scene is that? Five? Tom, just if you're looking, I'm going to just transition back to the Rebel Live hosts. Because we miss you so, so much that... Um, we, we got the perfect stand-in. We got the perfect stand-in for you. It's like, I, I, I had to look twice just to be sure that it wasn't you. <laughs> Here we go. Transition now. <laughs> so, um... <laughs> he's looking at the screen going, that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> so, Tom, I see that you're enjoying the sun down there, your little tan. <laughs> From the last time we saw you. Yeah, oh, you such really, a... You got a haircut, too. That, that's sun, man. Oh, man. I know. You should, that's sunscreen, though. <laughs> oh, so. So, yeah. So, um, congratulations to uh, Mr. Mr. Clancy for uh, for getting that very... Um, wait, I got I need glasses so I can see so bad. So, I can... Uh, so, yes. Good job on the quote. And... Um, now we know that IGN is watching your account. So, um, next, uh, this transition's horrible tonight. I know, but speaking of not being horrible, I don't know. <laughs> let's, uh, let's move on to the next one because this has been all a buzz for everybody. For oh, everybody? Like, for everybody. Well, well for me, I, I'm excited. No, I'm excited. I know my kids are excited. I know Rob well, Selig's excited. We're well, all excited. I'm excited, and I'm waiting to hear how they're going to be able to modify the 3DS for the video capture. That That's my only I know. part that it's, I'm excited you said, about. Th that was the first thing you said to me, too, when you saw this. It was the, the post on Facebook, right? Yeah, yeah. It's look like, at, now, look, look at the chat. <gasps> what reaction? Really? You don't... Syndicate. They haven't changed much. What? It's... Why the stupid Nintendo comment? I'm gonna quote you to Nintendo. <laughs> why? Tell us. Tell us why you feel that it's stupid Nintendo. Everybody seems to be kind of excited about it. I I'm not gonna lie. At first I thought, oh, because like when they made um, oh now they have the 2DS out again for like little kids. It doesn't fold up. It's just flat. It's stupid. That's to me. That's a marketing thing. They need well, to make more money. Well, that was supposed to be like the en the the entry drug to get into to get people to want to get the 3DS. Yeah, just for I the know, 3DS. but but and then the the extra large one for blind people. No. I <laughs> honestly, I miss having no. having the the 3DS XL because really? I had that. I I do. I had that before I I bought the the standard 3DS and got that modified. And honestly, at this point in time, I miss having the larger screen. Mm. Um, Syndicate says the question bec becomes: Will new games following its release will they be? Will they all be locked from older units? Hmm. I don't think I've actually I've read anything. Nobody has. That's a good question. Well, I mean, it is possible with the new because I know that there is a new button. There's two new buttons on on the new 3DS as well as that circle analog stick on the right hand side. So I can I can kind of see how that can be an issue where some games will require the new 3DS where yes, I, I do admit that will be uh, a very big downside. But I mean overall it um 
Yeah, so it, it will force gamers like who want to buy the newer games. Some of them, they may be forced to pick up the new 3DS, which, yes, is a downside. However, having, However we can ha- find having out. Having that analog stick, I don't know. I, I'm really tempted to see how, how they can take advantage of that. Well, let's find out. Old and new. <laughs> There's my transition. <laughs> That's a lot better. Isn't that? So so here we go, guys. Check out the link, and it shows you. Um, it's, okay. it's, it's bigger, like you like. Yeah, it, it, it's bigger. It'll be easier to hold in, ha- in the hand. Right. Um, Seems oh, there you go. So it's a, yeah. they're pretty much comparing it to the 3DS XL with the Circle Pad Pro right. slapped on it, which isn't too bad. I like that. Can't hurt, really? They should make an umbrella for blind people. Uh, like, what? Oh, Cantor, I'm just going to ignore that. <laughs> like, what would be the point <laughs> of a blind person playing a 3DS? They don't even know what 3D is. Syndicate says, I like the idea, but if it's about... But it's about the games. If, well, all, if all future games require the new system, they'll have shot themselves in the dick with their current user base. Uh-oh. Well, I mean, I can see that being an issue, but I'm pretty sure that, like, with them showing it, comparing to the Circle Pad Pro, not a lot of games are going to be taking or are going to be taking advantage of it. The only game that I really know off the top of my head that that used the Circle Pad Pro was Monster Hunter, and even that was completely fine without um, without having that. You use the I think it was the either the touchpad or the buttons to to swing the camera around. But I don't know. I mean I'm not gonna I'm not gonna start getting on their case yet. Yet. <laughs> um I mean I know I'm gonna buy it. I, I know that much already. Right. Now the question so is am I gonna at, have it modified? Yeah, know. if you look at the article and you scroll down to the second picture, I mean it looks like they added like a it's like adding a sidecar to a motorcycle. <laughs> Do you see what I'm saying? I mean, if you, yeah, look at the, yeah. if you look at the pictures, and then they, you know, obviously graphically, it's supposed to be better. So you got to scroll down and look at everything. But um, yeah, the battery life, it, God, about one for the new 3s is from three to five to six, three point five to six hours, and for the XL, three point five to seven, which. It's a big gap. That's um, that average, I guess. I don't know because if mine I think, starts I dying, know. I just plug it in and keep playing. So I don't. Really I, my know. 3ds is modified, so it dies yeah. faster. Oh. So anytime I play it, anytime I'm casting, it's always plugged into the power source as well. All right, gotcha. Wow, look how I just was looking at Twitter. How many times we spammed out? We were going live because I haven't hooked up like that. We were trying to get started, but all right. So um. We're going really fast today, because that's because Tom's not here. <laughs> yes, to break we're, his, we're getting his, a... his deep thoughts on all the articles. Yes, we need you, Tom. We miss you, Tom. We do. We do. Oh, my God, my water freaking tastes like an everything bagel. Ugh. I don't think that's good. Your water tastes like a bagel? Yeah, no, like an everything bagel. An everything bagel has, like, um, garlic on it. It has salt. It has... Um, poppy seed, sesame seed, um, whatever else you could get on a bagel, it's on there. But And for some reason, that's what my water tastes like right now. I just took a drink of it. That does not sound appetizing. No, it's not. I need different water. All right. Somebody did something to my water. So, um, oh, gosh, transition, transition. I'm, like, lost because I have two browsers open, and I'm not used to this, so it completely <laughs> has thrown me tonight. You know, Tom's going to come back yelling at me that my transitions were horrible. We're going to have to have a show on transitions now. <laughs> just, just, so, just so I can transition better. Tom nailed it last week with transitions, so I don't know. He's one-upped me. I can't top that. So um, let me see here. The you Did you put the... Oh, we're running that one? Okay. World of Warcraft. All right, so the post is up there. So yes, um, this, this is your um, story. 
Yes, it is. Um, actually, a friend of mine, Dusty Monk, put it up on his um, Facebook page, and uh, he's a he's a developer in the gaming industry, and he is an avid uh, Guild Wars 2 player. That's why I actually play Guild Wars 2 was because of his blog posts, and he is a even bigger World of Warcraft player, and um, and he um, sh uh, put this up on his. Um, if you read the post, um, it's kind of about uh, a couple that uh, games um, in WoW. Um, his wife leads a, a guild, and she's come down with a pretty uh, bad cancer, and they've given her about a year to live. Damn. And um, he's kind of thanking um, Blizzard for kind of, you know, uh, you know, they game together. I mean, that's like the ultimate couple you know what i mean like, yeah like yeah. you know what i mean so they're kind of thanking them for uh bringing them a lot of um awesome moments being able to game together and the community saying that they've been able to play with people literally from all over the world um there's a second link that goes with that i know last night they had a huge um event to raise money for her and uh, i think they raised uh, about five thousand dollars and um uh, but there's still um a link to her post, if you can't donate, could you just, if everybody could just take it and share it on your Facebook or your Twitter or, you know, whatever social media that you have in a forum, if everybody yeah. could share this. And um, I did donate myself. Um, this kind of touches close to home for me because I lost my sister three years ago to leukemia. So I know, um, I, I don't know how they feel, but I know their struggle. And, um, you know, after my sister had her bone marrow transplant, they told her after it failed that there was nothing they could do for her anymore. That was it. And so um, being kind of given, you know, that it, it sucks. So um, there, you know, she there is always a percentage of a possibility with cancers that are like this, that she's in that small percentage of group that that beats it. So right. um, that's why they're raising the money. So if you can share it or even if you can... I know that the the medical for this is it, it's huge, so um so yeah I just thought that that was something worth I'm gonna actually put this up on the um, website as well, so hopefully it gets a little bit more attention, and uh, I would appreciate it if everybody in the chat could even just um, take that donation link if you can't donate at least share it, and uh, get the message out about it. Um, hopefully um, her life can be saved. So. Um, so yeah, that wraps up our show. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tom, look at us. <laughs> We're just bang, bang, bang through the. <laughs> See, when Tom's here, we have that third person fill in. See, it's this, like this is what round... I get for it's holding a... back. This is it's, what I get for holding it's back. It's our round table. It's not working tonight because Tom is not here. So. All right, hold but, on. Let wait, me... no, no, no. I've got, I've got more. We can, dude. We can fill in. <laughs> so. So we can definitely fill in. I'm, wait, let me go to this. So we've got, uh, <laughs> yes, and D rocks. We've got more um, streamers um, possibly than we ever have. Rebel Gaming is coming up on its four-year anniversary. Um, and we've never really focused on our Twitch at all. We, we did, we used to do the Rebel Live shows and the Rebel Dead Zombie Apocalypse shows, but we never really had any definite streamers, which we're really trying to focus on now. And we are partnered, and we're trying to get uh, more subs. Um, the subs, um, it basically will help rub, run Rebel Gaming, the servers. And uh, we use a huge amount <laughs> of memory. <laughs> I know when we're using a huge amount because Will will message me, gosh, do you know how much we use? <laughs> and then I feel bad. So <laughs> Because... Um, Right now, uh, Will, our wonderful admin, he kind of takes care of the expense for the server. So I would like to alleviate him of that expense. And um, and so the subs uh, will also, we have, um, I'm, we're working on some shirts. And uh, those will go at a special price for subs, like almost $10 cheaper than the regular price for non-subs. Um, the Gamer Nights with John and Charlie and Havoc and Ray and me we yeah, are subs actually will have priority and also yeah, we're gonna and have i i have been i have been mentioning this oh yes we will have a minecraft server yeah i i have been mentioning this before i do have a sub goal set right now once we do hit 25 subs which <sighs> is first which is the first 
platform or the first yeah there's hit. it's done in like platforms. i i will be doing i don't want to do it i i hate scary games i will be doing a full and complete playthrough of outlast on the channel or which another one that has recently popped up which i i say this <laughs> with all the love in the world fuck all you people five <laughs> nights at freddy's if you have ever seen there's video oh, of john geez. playing it's at freddy's uh, there's video of John playing a game where he screams like a girl, and it's it's got to be the best. Dude, I I played it's, it's PT the best. and I I cut myself to the point where I was bleeding. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> playing PT because I jumped because I was not expecting that yeah, that first. So, although we found out the other night that I got scared pretty easily in my game coming up on that, uh, you were in stream. Do you remember that in Guild Wars? Oh, I, was, yeah. I, I was trying to find a way. I was trying to find that last point of interest in, and I couldn't find it. And I thought it was up around the corner, and I came up around the corner, and this huge fucking like spider thing came up out of the ground, scared the piss out of me. So, but well, see, that wasn't that wasn't too bad. That that was just a random mob that was that was standing around, and who just you know who you pulled the aggro from. But no. Five Nights at Freddy's? Oh. Freaking game. Oh. Or yeah. Outlast. I'm not I'm not looking forward to it, but I, I will play well, it. So, I, you know, I'll and and cry. like I said, subs get special stuff all the time. I'm always getting my hands on codes. And even codes that people want, not just uh not just uh you know ghost codes that nobody wants. <laughs> So. It's like, hey, hey, do you guys want to take these? Take them. <laughs> right? Oh, my goodness. Um, what else do we have coming up? Oh, on the 9th, we do have, what do we um, have? the 24-hour stream with VVV Havoc. For <gasps> Destiny. Yes, for Destiny. He will, be, uh, he will be on for 24 hours, and we should have some nice Destiny swag for people. Well, for subs that will be watching. And uh, so that'll be, that'll be nice. Anything else? Tom's going to be like, I'm so disappointed in you guys. <laughs> well, this is like the one week that I decided to hold back on my uh, avalanche of, of things that, hey, that looks interesting. We'll talk about it. Right. I, I, was, I was contained. I, I behaved. behaved. Now I know I shouldn't. <laughs> right. Always don't listen to me. <laughs> Just, just do whatever I, I think is right, and right. Too much stuff. Will and just then, cut and then I always complain. Oh my God, John! I have to spend my whole fucking morning doing the split with all of these pictures. Yeah, and stuff. that's what I have but to see, hear like, before the book was live. It's true, you do. <laughs> it, it's it's Steph just saying, why why the hell did you put up so much stuff? Just like, damn it. <laughs> but it's okay, cause see, you should have. You shouldn't listen to me. John, you should know this by now. You've been with us for a little bit. All right, so it, it's official. It's been announced on the cast that <laughs> what what she says, I should do the opposite of. It's it's official. Yes. <laughs> yes, I tell you, John, don't post so many links for news. The one time you had like I I had to I had no more room on my X play to put up, and I had to like group things in the same thing. It's very confusing. I was like nine A. <laughs> So, oh my god, just, obviously my haters have come. I know who this is. He's a fucking asshole. It's not 10 years ago, so you know what? <laughs> get out. Oh, seriously, I can't. I know who it is, and he's a fucking dick. Oh. I don't care. It's my show. I can say what I want. Fair so, enough. So, no, I do, I do know who it is. I stopped talking to him a long time ago because he's a mean and hateful person. So, and I don't have time for mean and hateful people. It's all positivity. We all just get along. Right. So, um, so yeah, I have, oh, if you guys have not been on our YouTube page, go on YouTube because I've been uploading some videos and stuff there. And, uh, and there's a video of the new guild that I am in. And I was, you know, I'm always amazed by how much people in this game know because there's so much to learn in this game. But, um, but yeah, so um, the guild leader Blaze is is running commander, and he just blows me away. And it would help if I learned some of the commands. So, <laughs> so um, so go check out um the YouTube. It's right there. It says it right there on your screen. 
So, and give us a follow. And you know what? I hate to say this. We just might have to wrap it up early tonight. It happens. It it's happens okay. sometimes. It's okay. It does happen sometimes. And that, that is okay. You it, know what, though? It, see, it we wrap, doesn't mean we, that we love you any less. Right. And we wrap up now. That, all that, the, that 15 minutes, that would have been Tom time. That little pie of 15 would have been Tom time. That would have been all of his fill-in time. And we just, you know what we should have done? We should have just oh, got we, sound we, we missed The thing that we missed, we, we missed out on your, your Rob story of the week. Oh my gosh. Didn't have that. Oh, I've got it. You guys there gotta give go. me, you give me freaking two minutes. I'm going to give you guys something. That is probably the best thing that you've ever, ever, <laughs> ever seen in your life. I, I have With, a feeling on what this can, what this is. Yeah, uh, now yeah. you've seen it. It was on his Facebook today. I, I saw the. Shh, shh, shh. I know. I'm gonna go. Well, I, I saw your post on it, but I'm not gonna spoil it. Don't spoil it because this is something that really needs to be seen and heard at the same time. So. I'm pulling it up myself. If I can get the you link. You pull up the link. It's the it's the whale one. The That's whale? my favorite one. Yes. I'm trying to find it. Trying wait, to find. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm on his page. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got ah, it. she's good. I got it. I got it. All right. I gotta mute it real quick while I get the link, or everybody's gonna hear it. All right. Now everybody knows that my son is Rob Selig, and he is um. He is at Rob Selig on Twitter. So after you see this, you must see Tom. Everybody go on Twitter. If you're, if you're listening to this and you see this, you must watch this video and you must tweet to Rob after you see this. Rob, when he lived at home, got it. And this, he was like 17, 18. No, I, I don't know. I'm trying to see the dates on these. Um, Rob would get bored and do videos. <laughs> <laughs> for pe for us and uh well well all i need to know is there that is our um vice president of rebel gaming rob selig and he does the best lip syncing that I've ever seen anybody do. John has seen this all morning on his facebook page. <laughs> you have to be impressed, am i not right? Right? <laughs> <laughs> that's the best video ever so you guys watch that real quick and i want you to tell me <laughs> what you think of it it's, um i think it's pretty impressive his skills that's my favorite video that he does on his youtube he has some survival um some survival videos he does um the pokemon theme song is really good i'm so proud of my son I, you think I'm kidding you. This needs to be like on, um, I don't know. He needs to go on American Idol or something. So this is my Rob story, is that this is what Rob, besides setting our houses oh. on fire, which he did a lot. Look, at they're laughing. <laughs> Wait, guys. this You have to, and please tweet to him. It's so worth it. Here's, here's the other one. That's the Pokemon song. And uh, let me tell you, this child has exceptional, exceptional um, um, skills. This is what he was hiding for years in his basement doing, was making these videos. And you can find them all on his YouTube. There's more. He's got two survival videos, how to survive when you're locked out of your house in your backyard. Um, as long as you have marshmallows. <laughs> so He d tries to do a very bad Australian accent. I'm not sure what it is, what kind of accent it is, but um, he does that one. Um, he does the Backstreet Boys. Um, he does SpongeBob. Um, he knows how to call whales. He knows how to call, yeah, that's what they just watched. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> John's cracking up. The, the love from the family. Oh, oh yeah. So, um. Yes, and you know what? Thank you for reminding me. I would have been very upset if I had not um, done the Rob story See? of the week. Ah. So I'm, I'm glad we could fill in and, uh, and Rob could do that. I told him, he came over this week and I said to him, I said, you know that we're, I'm going to have like a graphic made, Rob story of the week with like a picture of him. He does, uh, did I say he, I have the tire? You guys got to see, some of those videos are pretty um, epic. We might actually have a contest on the site. Who, what, which one is, is your favorite? of all of those very embarrassing videos that he's done. 
we'll, we'll, and then we'll a give vote. a we'll give a prize. We'll <laughs> give away like a maybe like a, a twenty five dollar Steam card or something. For the uh, best, the best video. One of his videos, I think it's like the Dora one, or one of them has like six hundred and something views. I'm like, are you kidding me? It's a child that lip syncs the stupid shit. <laughs> so you know, this goes in along with you know the Rob. You know, we know about Rob now that he collected Beanie Babies. He likes to light our, my house on fire. He did it two times, three times. He's built bombs <laughs> and hit them in his drawer, and he used to lip sync. So, boy, tune in next week and for another Rob story. I have. How can lots. we top this now? I know. Okay, this... so you got you got to come up with a good one. I know it's gonna. You have to be ready. I know, I know. I'm glad. Well, I'm glad actually because I think everybody should see those videos. I don't think that's something that should just be contained to just like random searches on. On YouTube, I think all of the people that surround Rob in his life need to know about those videos that he has made. <laughs> Can you imagine someday, like, oh, his kids oh. finding those? Would oh. you not die if that was your mom or, or dad doing, like, See, I, Dory videos? I, I would did make you, sure I delete those videos. If, did you if that watch was... the Pokemon one? Yes. He, I, does, the I... long, he does the extended <laughs> mix Pokemon one. It's not the short version. So, um, so yeah, that's, um, if I ever had children, I, I, I don't know if it wasn't like a huge hit and like just millions of views, I think I would delete it. I don't know. I know. There, there's just things that I, I would not. I think Rob's, want. I think Rob's proud of those videos. <laughs> you know what I mean? Someday, John, ask him, we're going to get him on the show. And when you, we do ask him to do his dolphin impersonation, he does a dolphin sound. And a sheep. Oh. He does really good animal sounds. It's kind of weird, but if you've got a skill, you know, flaunt it, right? I I guess. Oh, Charlie. But... Charlie boy, really? Yeah, oh. Charlie Cantor. They're they're trolls. They're they're <laughs> I know. they're they're my personal trolls that I <laughs> would love to find a way how to shut them up, but it's not possible. It's okay though. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> he just got tweeted. Oh, I seem to get much lip syncing. Such skills. Wow. <laughs> nice. Thanks, guys. I love it. That's great. <laughs> I, I told you, I I'm proud of my son. Those are some that that whale that doing um, Dory. That's some good lip syncing skills. He is like he nails it. And his facial expressions are pretty good too. So, just saying. I, and I hope Tom sees those. I'm actually think I'm gonna send those to Tom privately to make sure that he does not miss out on um on Rob's videos because I think Tom needs to tweet Rob about those. Did you see the Hakuna Matata one? Um, yes, I saw that one. That one was up on I think his Facebook page. Yeah, he had that, that one up one. too. Yeah. I still think the. Oh, that's his new one on his new Facebook. Yeah, he lo he loses the logins to all of his. It's it's a Google account. How do you how do I you thought, lose it's, that? It's Rob. You can, I can't even tell you how many times Will has had to reset his password for his RebGaming.com email. <laughs> like how hard is that? <laughs> do you know what I mean? Oh. I know, but that's another story in itself. So, <sighs> I'm reading the chat about you. <laughs> So, yeah, I got I got weird friends. They're they're do. creepy. So they're um, creepy. I guess we're gonna wrap it up. Thank you for joining us, everybody. Thank you uh, also for hanging out um, with the issues we had at the beginning. Um, also, I apologize for the uh, couple trolls that came in before. Those were people from uh, from uh, my gaming days in that MMO that did not like me, and uh, apparently they still don't like me seven years later. See, so, come to WoW, and everybody will like you there. No, well, okay. no, I didn't want people to like me, John. That was the whole point <laughs> of playing the way I did. But, um, but you know, in a game, you think that uh, that once you, you know, get out of it for a while and you grow up a little bit, that, you know, you realize it's just a game. But uh, apparently those people don't. So I apologize um, to my chat for for those people that came in. and uh, But they are banned now, so um, no more of them. 
Um, thank you, uh, Tom Clancy Standin, for joining with us tonight and uh, being our silent hero. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. And hopefully, Tom uh, will be ready to be back next week. Um, and uh, we will uh, see everybody. I guess. I guess next week, next Sunday. Um, I know that we've got. I got to check. We got to start prepping for The Walking Dead. Um, coming coming back up and back on uh the walking uh the rebel dead zombie apocalypse show will be airing alongside well afterwards or before we haven't worked out a time yet john i i, um, I guess that means that i'm gonna have to start watching the walking dead yes all right yes. So, um cantor um i'm gonna have to talk to you about that to find out where i can watch it or if you have dvds which would be more i have preference since i can talk about that online i have netflix News. Well, Netflix only has season one, two. Wait, no, is it? What season does are they on right now? Uh, I'm not sure. Because I know that they have like one to three. Hmm. Well, to start watching there. Like you're worried that we we can find you the others. <laughs> so. These ones are ready, but yeah. a long time. I'm gonna have to watch those again. So we gotta find me season four. And going on from there. Yeah. Well, start with one. You haven't even started with one, so you just start. Just start watching. This way, when we do the Rebel Dead show, you'll be up to, up to par with everything, and, and you can freak out the, the people that come into chat like I did as well and piss them off. So, oh, all right. I'm going to become one of those walking anyways. dead people. Yes, you are. Yeah, so you let, me, let, me, let me see with Cantor and you guys can figure this out. Start watching them, though. Oh, there we go. All right. All okay. right, guys. So I'll be good in that part. All right. Thanks for coming, and we will see you guys next week. We are out. All right. Take it easy, guys.